I'm currently late right now for the ensemble audition at Radio City. I'm here at Radio City. I'm auditioning today. My audition's at 10 for the ensemble and I'm excited and nervous. Hey guys, it's Caroline here and today I'm going to be spending 24 hours in my car. Not actually, but kind of actually. Story time, Rachel is doing the Radio City audition. Me and Ellie had to come along too because we have classes later today at ABT. So we're here. I have to sit in this car literally all day. It's hard to find parking so I'm just sitting in this car so we don't get a ticket. I'm stuck here. It's kind of like my second home. If you want to know a little bit what it's like, First off, we're in New York City. So there's always people walking. There's um, construction, as you can probably hear. There's a lot of beeping. Sometimes there's crazy people. Guys, my mom just texted me. She's gonna bring me some croissants. You're pretty desperate in here and bored. Basically anything you can find to eat, you eat. It's currently 10 a.m. I've been in this car since 7 a.m. I only had one bathroom break. I've been editing my birthday vlog. It's a lot of footage and I hope I have it done in time. I have a lot of editing to do. I also like to just go to Instagram and scroll. I brought school, but I'm not gonna do it. All right, that's the tea. See you guys when something interesting happens. Rachel, have a great audition, baby. I'll see you when you get back. Good luck, Rach. Up to the seventh floor, and then I have to walk up to the ninth floor. It's so cool to be back in Radio City. I'm late. It's now 11, and I'm just like editing, and then I was on Instagram. If you guys don't know, you are supposed to wear sunscreen every day, okay? The rays from the sun are not the best for your skin, and they can cause premature aging. You're supposed to reapply it every two hours. I'm using this Baby Clear Mineral Sunscreen from Alba Botnica. My mom likes this brand. This is a mineral sunscreen, so it does leave kind of a white cast, you can probably see. So I'm just gonna take a generous squirt. I recently started this whole sunscreen thing. The whole family thinks I'm crazy, but I'm just trying to invest in my skin for the future. So yeah, that's the update. Probably gonna edit the vlog, and I don't even know when Rachel's done. Now it's lunchtime. First up, I'm gonna eat this salmon and green bean leftovers. Next up on the menu, we have some homemade cookie dough that Rachel made. It was like made with chickpeas, so it has some protein. I just accidentally turned on the turn signal. Thankfully it turned off, but like I don't know how cars work. It's almost 1 p.m. and I just read and wrote stuff on my history. I in an hour and a half, so I'm gonna get to get out of this car soon. All I've been doing is editing, eating whatever I can find, and putting on SPF. I hope the audition's going good with Rachel. You better nail it, because I don't want to suffer for nothing. Let's do some makeup. Okay, the battery ran out, but my mom just texted me that Rachel made it to the end. So at least now we're moving. We're driving to ABT because Rachel finally finished. I need to do my ballet bun. My class is in like an hour. I made it to the end of the Radio City Ensemble Audition, so I'm really happy. But I'm also really tired. It's 1.30 and I have classes at ABT for the rest of the day. And rehearsals till 4.30. Guys, it's the moment of truth. I'm about to go out and get my legs stretched and go to my class at ABT. I have class in like 45 minutes, but I just want to get out of this car, so I'm going early. Finally, 
Feels good, I need a stretch. Now I'm gonna go to class. to point class, then I had character, and then I had a seven sonatas rehearsal for our spring show. So now I'm done with classes and rehearsals at ABT, took out my hair like I always do. Now I'm going to go down to the car and eat my dinner. I'm hungry, I'm tired, and I'm ready to sleep. I basically sat in the car from 7 to 1.45 with a little bathroom break. And now I get to sit in for like two and a half more hours. I finished my classes. I was in classes for like roughly four hours. It was fun to be not in the car, but we're back. I'm kind of tired, so I don't feel like going anywhere, but I could, but I also have to edit. I'm gonna eat my dinner. We have some chili and cornbread. We also got a dozen crispy cream donuts. Elby's class finished and my mom's going to get her. So we're gonna be driving home soon and I'm gonna eat a donut because we have these. Real quick, I wanted to talk about what the Radio City Ensemble audition was like. There was two days of auditions. The first day they made a lot of cuts and then I made it to callbacks, which was the second day which I vlogged. The second day was also a long day. We mostly just reviewed all the combinations that we learned. I think we learned six or seven combinations from different parts of the show. I think they were really trying to see who could like pick up choreography fast. And a lot of the pieces I recognized from when I was in the show. I did Clara for four years with Radio City which was one of the best experiences of my life. I learned so much and it really helped me learn how to work hard, be consistent. I always look back on those with great memories. The second day of auditions, the callbacks, they didn't make any cuts. The audition went from 10 to one, so it was like three hours. I'm pretty sure I was the youngest one in the audition because you have to be 18 by the fall and I was still 17 at the time of the audition, so I'm pretty sure I was the youngest one in the room. It was like such a good experience to have, especially at such a young age. I had a good time, I learned so much, I worked hard, Everyone at Radio City is always just so professional and nice. I unfortunately did not get the role of ensemble this year, but I really hope to audition again next year. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. I hope you learned something. It's 9 p.m. and we just got home. Here's Coco. She's here at home. After being in the car for literally nine hours today, I'm finally done. And I'm never getting back in a car again. Coco has spent a total of two minutes in the car. Oh, you didn't like that? Wow, cool. I spent nine hours. Now I'm gonna go inside and go to bed and never go in a car again. Hope you guys enjoyed this amazing vlog of me in the car literally all day. Subscribe so you can get an apartment in the city. No. Um, I think. That's probably gonna make me go insane in a couple minutes. I love cars. What time did we leave? This morning feels like so long ago. I literally can't remember. We left at seven. Callbacks. The birdie. It's 11 p.m., which means I'm gonna try. I just rubbed my eyes and I have mascara because they're gonna have wrinkles when they're older, and I'm not. We'll see who's the boss. Yay. Red and writ and wrote. You better get cast, Rachel. Why is it zooming? My mom just texted. Oh my goodness. I don't have time for this. My mom. Why is she spamming the unlock button? Don't forget to keep vlogging. That's blurry, so focus. People who love my vlogging. Wait, this is a good light. I hope we can have fun editing this. All the shots are literally the exact same because I had to sit in the car for like six hours. <laughs> oh no. Ew. <laughs> it was a water burp, okay? I just drank water. No. That's embarrassing. I don't even burp that much. Don't put that in the video. It's so late. Lies. You better not put that in my favorite. Stop lying.
Thumbnail. Stop, 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 stop. Coco, don't do that. Right, Coco? What was that? Okay.